Welcome to Ready, Set, Go, Volume 2. If you are an instructor, make sure to read the featured blog on important details on how to use this easy class template. If you are exercising to this video or audio download, make sure that you have a physician's clearance and as always, exercise at your own pace. Because this is a workout, we're going to get started at the pool. I'll give you more details during the warm-up. <laughs> Let's begin with an easy jog. At your leisure, perform jumping jacks and cross-country ski. Rotate through these three exercises for the next several minutes, focusing on slowly warming up the body, increasing the range of motion, and using different arm patterns to help warm up the upper body. While you warm up, here are the details of the workout. Once again, make sure you have consulted your physician before attempting this workout or any exercise program. Work at your own pace. While this workout is designed to be non-stop with no preset breaks in between sets, that doesn't mean you have to keep going. Take a rest or water break as needed. There will be an official water break given at the halfway point. Make sure you have your water bottle poolside. This workout includes a three minute set prep followed by seven muscle groups. In each muscle group, you will perform two strength exercises back to back with no rest for four sets. You'll follow that up with two endurance drills back to back with no rest for four sets. Once the pair of strength and endurance has been completed, you'll move on to the next muscle group. Muscle groups in order include chest, legs, triceps, back, legs, biceps, and core. Now, now that you know the details of the workout, it's time to begin our official three minute set prep. Ready, set, go. We're gonna begin bouncing with our feet together and our arms right by our sides. It begins with a curl of the arms, lift the arms to the front, Open up to the side, close to the front, side and down. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Curl your arms, bring them down, lift them to the front, bring them down, go to the side, hands together, open and close. Curl to the side, lift your arms to the front, open up, sweep the pool water at the top and bring them back down. Here we go, you're gonna open, sweep, open and close. Curl the arms, lift them up. Open, sweep, open and close. Curl, lift the arms, open, sweep, open and close. You're gonna curl, release, lift the arms, release, open, close, open and close. Here comes the legs. Side leg lift, back leg lift, and then a circle all the way around. Your leg goes front, it lifts to the side, it lifts to the back, and it circles all the way around. Your right leg lifts to the front, lifts to the side, lifts to the back, and it makes a big circle all the way around. Left side, it lifts to the front, it lifts to the side, it goes to the back, and you circle all the way around. So you have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It lifts to the front, goes to the side, to the back, circle the leg around. One, second lift, third lift, make a circle, change sides, lift one, second lift, third lift, circle around and our last minute now is land tempo jogging okay so pumping the arms driving the knees up and keeping a vigorous pace you're going up 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 pump 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 keeping it going now for to finish out this last minute of our set prep all right keeping this solid pace right so run 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 all right pump Pump, pump, pump. Keep moving the arms. It is your final step to warming up for our Ready, Set, Go workout. You're almost done. Continue to keep running. All right, you have 
run, 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 run. Pump your arms. You should be feeling really good now and getting ready for our Ready, Set, Go workout. There we are. That concludes our set prep warm-up. Let's get ready for our first set. Okay, let's get ready for our first muscle group, chest. Now place the left leg on the front into a stride position and take your right arm out to the side with your palm facing forward. We're gonna sweep the right arm across the front of the body. So sweep and then circle around nice and easy. All right, sweep the arm, circle around and get back to your starting point. Sweep the arm, push with the palm of your hand, one more. Now it's a repeater three chest fly, right? So you're gonna push, 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 and come back to the beginning. And as you push, you start to lower the arm down slightly. So chest, torso, hip, and back up. Chest, torso, hip, slow it down. Chest fly, circle it easy, right? Push with the palm of the hand, circle the arm around. Two more. Last chest fly circle. Now the repeater three, right? Pushing quickly. So you have three, two, one. Bring the arm back up. Three, two, one. Bring the arm back up. So your chest, torso, hip, back up. Last one. Now quickly you have to change to the other side. Your left arm is gonna sweep across, circle around. Your right leg is on the front this time. Two more slow chest fly circles. Last one. Now here's your repeater three. Are right, you gonna push, 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 release. Push, push, push. All right? So you chest, torso, hip, and come up. One more. You're gonna go back to your slow chest circle fly. Sweep across. Right. Pushing with the palm of the hand. Big chest circle. One more. Now here's your repeater, chest fly. It's one, two, three, and release. Chest, torso, hips. All right, continue to push the arm in. Last one, we're getting ready for the endurance phase of our set. It's a chest press wide and in along with your jumping jack. Jump it out, jump it in. Jump it out, jump it in. Your arms push wide and in, wide and in. From here, we call this exercise the pec deck. Cross country ski and squeeze the inner arms and the elbows together right at chest height. You have eight, seven, six, five, four more. Back to the chest press and your jumping jack. Press it wide, press it in. Jump your feet out, jump them in. We're gonna repeat these two exercises several times, so give yourself the opportunity to learn. And I promise the next few reps will be just as good. Here we go, cross country ski and your pec deck. Squeeze, squeeze. You're squeezing the arms to the inside, working your chest. You have eight more, seven, six, five, four, three. Back to chest, press wide and close. Bring it in, jump it out, bring it in. Jump out and in. Press. Two more. Pec deck, cross country ski. Squeeze your arms, chest height. Elbows come together, inside of the arms come together. Eight. One more set, chest press and jumping jacks, right? Push out, push in. Four more here, four, three, two, your last set of cross country ski and pec deck. Ski, 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 right? Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze the arms. Eight, seven, four more, three, two, and one. Great job, let's move on now to the legs. You're gonna anchor here the left leg down and the right knee is going to come up and push down back to the ground and then we'll add a front leg kick. So here we go, we lift the knee, put it down, straight leg kick to the front. 
Knee up and down, straight leg kick to the front. Knee up, knee down, straight leg kick. You have one more. We're gonna take this kick to the back. Knee up, kick to the back. Knee up, put it down. Knee up, back kick. Knee up and down. Two more. Last one. We go back to the kick on the front. Knee up, put it down, straight leg lift. Yes, knee, put it down, straight leg lift. So you should be feeling here, your hamstrings and your glutes as you pull the leg down. One more. Now take your kick to the back, knee up, back kick. Knee, put it down, and again, driving your leg back, feeling your glutes and your hamstrings do the work. You have one more. Knee, back kick, we've got to switch to the other leg. Left knee, lift, lower straight leg up. Knee, lower straight leg up. Two more, knee up, straight leg lift. Last one, now the kick goes to the back. Knee up, kick to the back, knee up, put it down. Up, kick to the back, put it down. You have two more here, last one. Let's go back to exercise one. The kick goes to the front. Knee lift, down straight leg kick. Knee up, down straight leg kick. Two more. Last one. Your kick goes to the back. Knee up, kick back. Knee, put it down. Up, back. Last two. One more, we're getting ready for our endurance phase. It is double front kicks to the front. So kick right two times, then kick left two times. Kick right two times, kick left two times. So it goes kick, kick, and kick, kick. Our second exercise is triple hamstring curls. So one, two, three is your rhythm. Curl the heels back towards the glutes in that rhythm. One, two, three. One, two, three. Curl, curl, curl. Now back to the front kicks. Two kicks on the right, two kicks on the left. You go kick, kick, switch, kick, kick, switch, kick, kick, switch. Two more. Now your triple hamstring curls in your rhythm. Curl, curl, curl. Curl, curl, curl. Heels go back towards the glutes, knees point down. Curl, curl, curl. Two more sets. You are back to your kicks to the front. Kick on the right, kick on the left. Remember, two kicks right, two kicks left. Four more. And now your repeater three curls. One, two, three. One, two, three. All right? Curl, curl, curl. Don't forget to move your arms here. They're gonna really help you keep the legs moving in that triple pattern. Kick, last set. Four more, four, three, two, and your last set of hamstring curls. Here we go, curl, curl, curl. Curl, curl, curl. Curl, curl, curl. Four more sets. Here's three, two, last one. And there we go, fantastic. Let's move on. We're getting ready now for our third muscle group, the triceps. You're gonna bring your arms close to your side and your palms facing forward and your elbows bent. Okay, we're gonna press down towards the hips, then press back behind you and bring the arms back up to the beginning position. So we press down, push back, slice the arms back up. Push down, then push back, and then slice the arms all the way back up. Now, triple repeater presses, right? So you're gonna press, press, press. Now you press in a low V, get closer, and now close to your side body. So out, bring them in, bring them in. Now back to the beginning exercise. Press down, press behind, slice your hands. Press down, push behind, slice your hands. Press down to your hips, push behind, slice your hands up. Now you're getting ready for repeater tricep presses, right? They go three, 
two, one, release. Press wide, a little closer, and then close to your side body. Press wide, a little closer, close to your side body. One more set. Back to the beginning exercise. Press down, press back, slice your hands up. Push with the palm of your hand, press back, slice your hands up. You have two more sets. Last one. Now your triple presses. One, two, three, release. Press, 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 release. It goes wide, a little closer, right by your sides. One more. And back to your beginning exercise. Press down, press to the back, slice your hands up. Press down, press to the back, slice your hands up. Two more. Last one, and this is your last set of your triple tricep presses. Press, 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 and release. Right, strong through the palms of the hands. Remember, you're pressing wide, a little closer, close to your side body. Last one, here comes our endurance phase. Right, so speed bag with the arms, and just easy heel digs. So heel, 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 inhale, and at the same time, continue to roll the arms over each other. Four, three, now knee lifts and tricep press downs. Every time your knee comes up, both of your arms press down by your side. So press, 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 press. You have four more. Now heel digs and speed bag. Keep rolling your arms. There's four more, three, two, knee lifts, and press your arms down. Make a fist, it will make it much easier to sustain the tricep endurance in this phase. All right, but strong, press down, press down, press down, press down, you have four more, three, back to your speed bag. You should be feeling the triceps working now. You have four more sets of heel digs. Three, two, knee lifts, and press the arms down. Right, you're only bending through your elbows. Every knee lift gets an arm movement. Press, 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 press. Four, three. Okay, last set of your speed bag. and a rhythmic heel dig. You have eight, seven, six, five, four, three. Last set of the knees and the tricep press down. Only eight more to go. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. That concludes our first set of muscle groups of our Ready, Set, Go workout. Let's take an official one minute water break. As you get a drink of water, let's talk about water. Why is it so important? Athletic performance declines with dehydration. You just can't work as hard. Water acts as a lubricant for your muscles, joints, and vital organs. Water is the transporter of oxygen and glucose in your body, and it is important for providing energy. Not enough water equals not enough energy. How much water should you drink? That differs with people, but the rule of thumb is to drink water before, during, and after exercise. So be sure to drink lots of water. The workout will resume in about 30 seconds. Let's get ready to begin our second set of muscle groups. We start off with the back. Place your left leg on the front and your right leg on the back and extend your right arm out in front of you. We're gonna be pushing here with the back side of the hand. You're gonna push to the back and then circle the arm around, right? Push with the back side of the hand and circle the arm around. 
So it goes like the letter T, and then bring the arm back to the front, push back. Now we have that repeater three push, just like the chest press. One, two, three, and come up. You're pushing backwards, 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 and release. It's chest, torso, hips, and come up. Push back, back, back. Now that slow reverse fly and circle the arm around, right? It's hard to push backwards, and then it's easy when you return. Push back with the back of your hand. You have one more, and here comes the repeater three push. You're pushing backwards, back, back, and come up. Back, 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 and come up, right? Really using your backside to move the arm. Last one, now here we have to change sides quickly, right? Your arm is pushing with the back side and your left leg now is on the front i'm sorry your right leg is on the front and your left arm is doing all the work there is your repeater three right you're gonna push back 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 and up push back 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 right so chest height torso and hip one more now your slow reverse fly. Push with the back side of your arm and your hand. Circle around and rest. Push, circle around and rest. You have two more. Last one here. And here comes your repeater three. Pushing back. One, two, three. Push, push, and push. Right, you push chest height, torso, hip, one more, we're getting ready here now for the endurance phase. Right, jumping jacks with alternating bow and arrows. Your one arm goes straight out to the side and your other arm pulls like it's pulling a bow. You have two more. Last one, now back hopscotch. Curl the legs behind you and bring your opposite hand to your opposite heel. Okay, so this is hopscotch with the lat pull down. You have four more, so four, three. We're back to the jumping jack and the bow and arrow. You're gonna pull, come center, jump out, pull center, jump out, pull center, jump out. Right, every time you jump out, you pull your bow and arrow. Two more. Now back hopscotch and your lap pull down. Your opposite hand reaches for your opposite foot. You have eight more here, eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, bow and arrow and jumping jacks. Pull your bow and arrow, come to the center. Pull and come center. All right, jump out, jump in, jump out, jump in. Two more. Lat pull down and your back top scotch. Pull the arms down behind you, touching the heel that is also behind you. Eight more, eight, seven, Six. Bow and arrow, last set of jumping jack and bow and arrow. Four more. And here comes your last set of lap pull down and your back hopscotch. Pull down, pull down, pull down, pull down, hop. There's eight, seven. Four more, and rest. Great job, let's move on. We're moving on to the side leg this time. You're going to anchor your left foot down and move your right leg out to the side, a side leg lift. So here we go. The right leg's gonna go knee up and down, lift to the side and return. Knee up, put it down, lift to the side and return. Two more. Now the same leg, you're gonna reach for your ankle, cross the leg over the middle, bring it up and put it down, right? So reach for your ankle, cross your foot over, and put it down. So lift the leg, cross kick, and return. Lift the leg, cross kick. Now go back to the side leg, knee up, down, side leg lift. Knee up, down, side leg lift. Two more. Last one. Moving on to that ankle reach, right? You're gonna reach, cross your leg over, knee, back down. So turn the leg out, 
before you cross it over. Leg, kick, and down. Last one. Now we have to switch sides fairly quickly. Here we go, left knee, put it down, side leg lift. Left knee, put it down, side leg lift. Last one. Here comes that ankle reach on the left side, right? Reach for the ankle, kick the leg over, and down. Reach for the ankle, just cross that leg right over the midline. Lift the knee, cross, one more. Back to your side leg lift. Knee up and down, side leg lift. Knee up, down, side leg lift. Two more. Last one. Here comes our ankle reach and our crossover kick. Ankle reach, crossover kick, ankle reach, and down. Ankle reach, cross it over, and down. Two more. You have last one, and we move right into our endurance exercises. Pendulum swing. We're gonna single, single, and double. All right, so you're gonna swing single, single, and then hop two times right here. Swing the legs out to the side, and make sure your arms move opposite of your arms. Second exercise, three ankle reaches and a side kick on your right leg. Three ankle reaches and a side kick on your left leg. So you're going right, left, right, right side kick. Left, right, left side kick. Pendulum swing, doubles. Single, single, doubles. Right, really powering this exercise through the insides of your legs. Single, single, now ankle reaches. One, two, right side kick. One, two, three, left side kick. So right, left, right, right side kick. Ankle reach left, and left side kick. Pendulum swing, doubles. Right, make sure you're swinging your arms in opposition of your legs. You have two more pendulum swings. Last one here. Now your front ankle reaches. Right, three, two, one, right kick. Three, two, one, left kick. Three, two, one, right kick. Three, two, one, left kick. Pendulum swing, last set. Single, single, double. Single, single, double. Single, single, ankle reaches. So right, left, right, and kick. Left, right, left side kick. Right, left, right side kick. The last one here. And that completes our series on the legs. Let's move on. We are gonna work on the biceps. So plant your feet shoulder width apart, maybe just a little bit wider, and take your arms by your sides and glue your inner arms to your side body. Palms are facing up. We're gonna curl the arms up, release nice and easy, and then lift the arms straight up to shoulder height and bring it back down. So you curl the arms with the elbows, release back to your side, and then lift the arms straight up and back down. Now, we have repeater three curls, very similar to the triceps. The pattern here is curl, curl, curl. Do it again, curl, curl, curl. Now your bicep curl, easy on the way up. And then straight arms all the way to shoulder height and bring them down. Right, curl through the elbow joint. Then easy all the way up. Now your repeated three bicep curls. Okay, they go out, closer, and all the way in. So wide, center, and then close to your body. So curl, curl, curl. Last one. We go back to that nice slow biceps curl right here. Curl, palms up, easy release. Palms up, straight arms up to the shoulders. Easy on the way down. Curl through your elbows. And then straight arms all the way up in front of you. Now your repeater three bicep curls. It goes out, in, and then all the way in. So keep moving the arms closer with every single curl. Three, two, one. Last set of repeaters. And our nice slow biceps curl. So curl up, easy on the way down. Straight arm lift. 
Easy on the way down. Last time, curl. Easy on the way down, straight arm. Repeater biceps. One, two, three. Go out, come in, come all the way in. One, two, three. Okay, last one here, our endurance. Uppercut flurries, you're gonna make a fist, punch the water, and just give yourself these little hops, almost like a tuck jump, so it goes down, up, down, up, down, up, down, up, while you're doing your flurries. Now, knee lifts and alternating biceps curl. Every time you have a knee lift, your opposite arm curls. Okay, so you have eight, seven, six, five, four, three, flurries and hop. Up, 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 up. Drive your knees up just a tiny bit, right? Just like a little hop. Keep flurrying your arms. Just a few more. Now alternate your knee lifts. Curl, curl your arms. Right? Curl really aggressively here and also with the palms up. So push a lot of water up to the surface. Four more. Three. Flurries and your hops. Flurry. 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 Right? Down and up. Down and up are those legs. You have eight, seven, six, five, four, three alternating knee lifts and alternating biceps curls. Every knee lift gets a curl. Eight more, seven, four, three, two, one, flurry. Right, keep lifting those knees up. You have eight to go, so you have eight, seven, six, five, flurry, flurry. Alternate your knees and alternate your biceps curl. You keep pushing the water up towards the surface, strong with your hands. Eight. Four more. And that is the end of our bisex segment. Okay, here we go. Last exercise for the core. You can put your right leg on the front. Put your hands together also at the front at belly button height. Right, and squeeze your palms together. You're going to make a figure eight with your arms, but what you want to feel is the figure eight with your torso, right? Your belly should be making the figure eight as long, along with your arms. Now, second exercise, lift the right knee, rotate your hands over the knee. It's a lateral knee and rotation at the same time. So knee and turn, center. Knee and turn, come center. Knee and turn come center. Back to your figure eight. Put your right leg on the front, left leg on the back. Make the arms in that figure eight pattern. All right, there's three more. Two. Now lateral knee and rotation on your right. Turn and rotate towards your right knee. And your right knee is coming out to the side. Okay, right, so four more. Side knee and turn. Last two, now we've got a quick, or switch quickly to the left side. Put your left leg on the front and begin your figure eight pattern with your arms. Right, keep squeezing your palms together. Two more here. Now lateral knee on your left side and rotate on your left side. Lift the knee and turn at the same time. Knee and turn, knee and turn. Four more, three, Two, left leg back on the front, figure eight arms. Okay. Eight more here. Get ready for lateral knee on the left and rotation on the left. Knee and turn, knee and turn. Lift, lift, four to go. We've got to finish up our segment with our endurance. So taking the right leg, you're going to bent knees, swing forward and back, make a big circle, do it again. Swing the leg forward, swing the leg back, and circle all the way around. Swing the leg forward, swing it back, circle all the way around. Last one. Next exercise, three skis with a rotation. You're going to ski for three, and then jump up just a little bit. 
rotate the arms, the upper body. Now pull the arms down on the jump. So ski, 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 pull the arms down. Ski and rotate, ski and rotate, pull the arms down. Here comes the left leg. Bent knee, swing, circle around. Forward, back, circle around. Right, left leg swings front, swings back, it circles around. One more. Now you know the exercises. Cross cut you see with the rotation. Turn, 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 jump and pull the hands down. So rotate, ski, ski, pull the hands down. Ski three, two, one, pull the hands down as you jump, ski. Go back to your right leg, swing it. Front, back, circle all the way around. Bent knee, front, back, swing, circle all the way around. One more. Cross country ski with rotation, right? Sweep your arms across the top. Pull your arms down. Ski three, two, one. Pull the arms down. Ski, pull the arms down. One more. And now your left leg, bent knee leg swing. Come forward, back, circle around. Two more on your left side. Last one. Cross country ski. Ski three with rotation. Jump up, pull the arms down. Ski three with rotation. Jump up, pull the arms down. You have two more. And this is the last one. Great job. And that concludes the Ready, Set, Go workout. Before exiting the pool, take a few minutes to stretch, slow down your breathing, and lower your heart rate down to a comfortable level. Choosing a stretch for each one of the muscle groups can help maintain or improve flexibility, range of motion, and prevent injury. FitMotivation.com videos feature many ideas for post-workout stretching. I am confident that you will enjoy teaching or working out to this pre-formatted strength and endurance class without having to worry about, what should I do next? Follow the order, follow the timing, and this Ready, Set, Go workout will absolutely be one of your favorites.